With the recent release of Fedora 43 Workstation Edition, some people on my channel have asked for a guide on how to upgrade from Fedora 42 Workstation Edition to Fedora 43. Thankfully, it's very easy, but I do want to mention the disclaimer that before I begin, I strongly recommend you back up any critical data that you might have before attempting this upgrade. Sometimes flukes happen and you might be left on an inoperable machine or even data loss. So a good rule of thumb is back up before continuing on. Anyhow, with that all said, let's jump into it. All right, first things first, if you haven't already logged into the machine, then let's log in right now. And then on the system dock down at the bottom, let's click on show apps and then go into settings with the gear, click on that. And then just to confirm, let's take a look at about. And we're just confirming that we are in fact on the previous version of Fedora, which is version 42. So we can click back and then go down to the bottom for software updates, click on that. I also just wanna mention that before we continue on with this, it's good to back up any critical data that you might have. There's always a chance that something will hiccup during the upgrade process. So if there is anything you need that is critical, please back it up before continuing on with the upgrade. First thing I like to do is I like to make sure that the current version that is installed is actually up to date before we make the jump. So let's click on the download button and then let's wait for this to download. And once it's done downloading, we have the restart and update button that will appear. Let's click on that. And then this will take a little bit of time. So just wait for it to crunch. And eventually you should see the restart and install or if you do nothing, it should restart in 60 seconds and start counting down in 10 second blocks. Anyhow, we'll click on restart and install. And then once it starts booting up, then we should see the upgrade screen happening. And let's just wait for this to crunch. Just as it mentions, do not turn off your machine during this process. Then it should reboot again. And then let's log back in and continue on with the process. All right, so let's go back to the dock. Let's rinse and repeat what we kind of did previously. So show apps. Go to the gear icon for settings and then under software updates, click on that. And then hopefully you should see the Fedora Linux 43 is available. And then we'll click on download. And then depending on your network connection, this could take a little bit of time, but anyhow, we will wait for this to download and then we'll continue on once it's at the next section. And just to let you know, it may hang at certain sections and then it will randomly just jump forward again. So just be patient as it continues to crunch if it does hang at a certain percentage. And then once it's done downloading, we should see a restart and upgrade button. And just as it mentions and warns us again, remember to back up data and files before upgrading, just to make sure that you don't lose anything if an upgrade goes bad. Anyhow, I'm perfectly fine with my setup, so I'll click on restart and upgrade, and then type in your credentials, hit enter. And then just as it mentions, Fedora Linux 43 will be installed after restart. Upgrade installation can take a long time. Ensure that you have backed up and that the computer is plugged in. So that's another thing. If you're on a laptop, make sure that it's plugged into power during the upgrade process. Let's click on restart and install once we're ready. And at this point, we're just going to watch the upgrade screen crunch along just as it did for the normal updates. And then we'll continue on once this is done. And then at some point it should reboot on its own. And then we should hopefully see the login screen. So again, type in your credentials and hit enter. And one good sign is that we see the little space shuttle background. But just to confirm, if we go back down to show apps, go back to the gear icon for settings. And let's take a peek at about. And then we should hopefully see Fedora Linux 43 showing up here. Now, one thing I do recommend is go back and then go to software updates again. And then let's just click the little refresh button up here just to make sure that everything is in fact up to date after the upgrade and everything looks good there. So, so that's all you need to do to upgrade from Linux Fedora 42 Workstation Edition to Linux Fedora 43 Workstation Edition. If you found this video to be useful, please like it and subscribe to my channel to keep up my latest video happenings. And until next time, take it easy.